Ever since I've been young, I was always really interested in the arts. I decided to go to art school. When it came time to work on my thesis, it happened to be about the partition between India and Pakistan. I started studying about objects that refugees had carried. That research very quickly took over my life and I found myself training to be an archaeologist of memory. My name is Anchal Malhotra. I was born in New Delhi. I am a writer and an oral historian. Our work on the Museum of Material Memory began many, many years before when I started working on a project around the partition of India, looking at uh, objects that refugees had carried from one side to the other side when they migrated from their homes. Me and my partner Navtha, we thought, wouldn't it be great if there was a digital archive where people could submit stories, where we could uh, collate them in their own words. The fact that it is a digital archive means that it is an easy way for everyone, no matter where you are, to be involved in submitting artifacts from their family. You give a certain voice to history and I was giving a certain voice to these objects that had migrated with people and carried migratory histories within them. It just really started becoming much larger than me. I think many people along the way will be telling you that you cannot do something because you're a woman. Because, you know, society thinks that it can comment on everything that you do because you're a woman. But I think it's very important to understand that women can do everything that men can do.